What is up, everyone? My goodness gracious. We're, uh, we're starting it off. I had to, I ran back to the tent. I was like, we need to start off early morning. So that's what we're doing. What time is it? Seven in the morning. Could, could have gone earlier, but we decided. Seven was, was the best anyway. <laughs> How's everyone doing? My goodness gracious. Starting off the week strong with a half and half Monday fun day. Let's see. Goodness gracious, there's so many people in the chat right now. The chat is just moving. Liberty Bibbity. Alex Super Stewie is here. Green Stando. Mac, Mac Hatch. Among Us Moments is here. Jonathan Castro. Jeff Bendick. Uh, Bryce Bendick. Braden Thompson. Tristan Jack. Brendan Smith. Thousand, 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 thousand subscribers. What's up? Beyond the yeah, Megan is here. Jason Widden. Rodney A. It's Chase. Tan Tan the Muffin Man is here. Alex Mangus. How's it going? My goodness gracious. I'm like trying to read the... I'm trying to get caught up. Jack Brellenthin is here. Jeremiah Cashin. Brendan Smith. Brendan Smith is new. And Sharon's here. Right on, Sharon. Mr. Gamer Guy YouTube is here as well. Hopefully I didn't miss anyone. Harrison Go. Been sub for years. Been sub for years. We can, we can. Oh, ooh, 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 ooh. look at this. Uh, Alex. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much, Alex. We got our first geese. Our first gooses. We'll have to watch them because I'm pretty sure they do this weird. Uh... They do this weird bug thing where they, like, are fine, and then all of a sudden they fly away in defense. So you like those ones. Why are, you, why are they flying away? Doesn't make any sense at all. Oh, we got... Oh, my God, we got so many geese. Alex Mangus, thank you so much. 10,000 subs, I'm so happy for you. Hey, thank you. Well, people like you and, and everyone who's in the stream right now, making it fun that's for sure but if we want to do this for reals we need to put on our hunting hats oh my goodness i feel like these geese are going to land too close to us we can see nah this goose is going to scare everything away i already know it oh we can try to hold on i'll wait i feel like these ones are going to see us before we get this second group to come down maybe not Let's go. Let's see these guys get in range. We got quite a few there. Right on. What a start. Two flocks in and now we got a handful of them. I'm not sure how many we got been liking your video so far well thanks brendan appreciate it congrats on the 10k thank you green stando i'm playing fishing planet and have the hunter in my console about to play right on brayden green stando rodney a 10k rodney a 10k yeah i i wanted to put together a uh, a little announcement thing for the uh, communications tab on youtube today i did, ran out of time Got your first smallmouth buffalo today. You're brought on this, Chase. That's awesome. I've almost finished your beginner series for Fishing Planet. Ah, oh, sweet. There's a lot of videos. I was surprised. I actually saw that the other day. There are a lot of videos on that. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. Are you playing Fishing Planet today? Absolutely. That's what we do. What is going on there? Are We have a floating... What is that? Silly, silly. Um, but yeah. We'll definitely do that every Monday. We do half and half, half and half Monday, because we got hunters, we got fishing people. You know, do a little half and half, a little bit of both. You know, wish I could fly away in defense. <laughs> Why are you wanting to fly away? <laughs> You're on the grind for the gray one. Oh, I see. Roger Cruz, hey BZ, how about hey Roger Cruz? How's it going? Ain't nothing like a good cup of tea. Good cup of tea. <laughs> Rice is here. I want to grind for the gray one, but whitetail just don't exist for me. Yeah, I've seen that for some people, where the whitetail just kind of 
become a very rare thing. See, the problem is that we got hit up with so many flocks of geese that it'll probably be a little bit before we see another flock, unfortunately. We should probably go... Oh, what was that about? I have to be like hyper aware. Okay, we got one goose. Two gooses. Three gooses. Congrats on the 10 8. Thanks, Chase. Four, four, am I still counting correctly? Four gooses? Good shots, BZ. Thanks, bro. Thanks, bro. I think we shot most of them over here. Let's go check. Nice job on the 10K. Can only dream that number for my channel. Yeah, well, goodness gracious. That was that was me, basically. I was just dreaming. No way I'm going to get up there. We're, we're getting up there, man. Cold phase, nice hat. Hey, thanks, man. Thanks, bro. It's going to start squeezing my noggin, though, so I have to be careful. <laughs> start getting a headache just because my hat's too tight. Like looking off in the distance at the same time as I'm running just to see if I can spot a flock of geese a long ways away. <laughs> Fallow deer tracks. Any geese over here? I know that we shot some, but I don't know if we killed them. I don't see any. Okay. Back to... Oh my god, all these falling leaves really freaked me out for a second. I thought they were geese. <laughs> Okay, back to the blind, back to the blind. You got no hand. Why is the screen pixelated? I don't know. Why is the screen pixelated? You need to change your uh, quality of the video. All right, we are in the blind. We are prepared for gooses, for geeses. Can you make another beginner series video, please? I love them. Yes. Um. Actually, there's one coming out on Wednesday, so I'm trying to like do that. I know that we have live streams and stuff, but I realize that like if people watch the video for the game or, you know, like like we play hunting and fishing on Mondays, but we play hunting on Thursdays. Like if I can kind of time it out to have like a fishing video on Wednesdays, hunting videos on Mondays or Thursdays or something like that. I don't know. Monday is kind of a wild card day, but yeah. You used to be a fishing people. Now I am all about Call of the Wild. Well, right on, G Madrid. Call me Brendan. Okay. What do you recommend trying to level up and get money in Fishing Planet? Ooh. Well, it just depends on what level you're at. Um, but walleye, largemouth bass, and northern pike are a good way to start out until you start getting into the 40s. Then you can kind of move into sturgeon if you want to. Um, yeah, up to you, really. Congratulations on your wedding. No pics to share with your community. <laughs> it was so tempting. So tempting, you know. Um, I shared one pic. That was enough. Get a little, get a little taste. How was your Thanksgiving? I had a pretty good Thanksgiving. Can't complain. We had to, you know, we're at the point now still where we're having to like split up Thanksgivings. So we had like lunch with uh, her family and then we went up for a kind of a light dinner and dessert with my family so it was a little weird in that in that way but it's just kind of because of covid and we couldn't combine the families together for everything so not a big deal once look for caribou wolves or wolverines after we went just over 100 miles we heard whole howls but never seen anything good well gosh darn it you got the four in one case right on the chase I have the head of the child, so hats are always way too big for me. <laughs> Understandable. When did you start? When did I start what, Carson Peters? But, uh, yeah, how was everyone else's Thanksgivings? That's for sure. <laughs> Depending on the fishing brand, PFG. Um, I think I have, uh... I have like one t-shirt I think of PFG. That's about it. I don't have much of an ex I don't have much experience to say much more, Mr. Gamer guy. Squish is here. How's it going, Squish? Jake Dial. Hello, Jake. 
Got your PB fish of all time, 4.6 pound catfish. Hey, right on, Tristan Jack, that's awesome. Got any diamonds? No diamond geese. In fact, no geese. We got hit up by two, three flocks in the very beginning, and it's been slow as bananas ever since. We might have to move on because this is getting boring for me, and I can't imagine it's much fun for people watching. <laughs> we had three flocks in the beginning. How many did we get? We only got four, I think. We shot, we shot quite a few. 80 Smee. 80 Smee. Can't wait for the Christmas season, bro. I can't wait for the Christmas season either. I got new stuff coming up. So, uh, it, it'll be good. Maybe Buck was chasing around 10 does. 10 does, my goodness gracious. Get you pumped up. <laughs> Roger Cruz. I couldn't get through your whole message. Dutch ABMA got a dirt bike. Right on, man. Okay, I'm giving this one more minute and then we're, we're ditching the geese. The geese are being too slow. Come on, geese. I get, we had a live stream hunting geese one time and we did not see like anything. We got like maybe, we sat there for two hours or near two hours and we may got three flocks. And, uh, and I went to a single player game after that and I must have got like, I don't even know, eight to ten flocks in like 20 minutes that I was playing. So I was really hoping that this would be the same way today. But uh, it's it's not, it's not, it's not feeling like that. It's not, it's not feeling like that right now. Okay, we're moving on. Let's go. Uh, I need to get some rifles. We'll, we'll go look around for some fallow deer and stuff. That'd be fun. Do 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 do. Let's put away one of our shotguns. We'll uh, get the 243 out, I think. I don't know if we need any more. This is the one I wanted. Okay, here we go. Giant max weight caribou only a gold, but nothing better than tracking it than taking it with a with a bow. Max weight. What is the max weight for a caribou? I don't even know. You should try Russian fishing four sometime. Yeah, after we complete fishing planet, we'll play other fishing games. Need three left. Hey, right on, Alex. That's awesome. Get those guard, bro. How do you set the decoys up? You know, it's honestly as simple as putting them in your inventory and then, uh, like a call. You know, if I were to take out this call, for instance, like, uh, it would be a decoy and then you just, you know, place it on the ground. Sorry, I don't really have a good example right now. Hey, that's not a bad one. How about you take a gun out? Ah, uh, he nail. God dang it. It's a freaking crouch thing again. How long has that crouch bug happened for us? When will it stop? When will it stop? Might have been a little low. Oh, well. When is the farming simulator coming out? You know, uh, my brother and I were actually going to start that this weekend, but he brought his uh, he brought his PlayStation to my parents' house, and he left his headset at my parents' house, so uh, he wouldn't have been able to talk to me or hear me the entire time. So we put the put the darn farming simulator on hold for a weekend. Hopefully by next weekend we can start getting one together and start editing it. Yeah. Do some burrow rabbit hunting. That is true. I have not done that yet. Nice old fallow, 192. On its way up. You have a 180s class buck. We're right on, Dutch. That's awesome. King Grant is here. How's it going, Grant? Try bonkers. How sneaky they are, so I keep away from rabbits on this game. You know, I don't even know where the rabbits are. Where should we go? Where should we go to find rabbits? <laughs> yeah, 
got in the butt. Sean B, how's it going? Sean B. Reminds me of John B. I like it. Putting you on blast. What games do you play off camera? You know, right now, I've been playing a little bit of uh, Age of Empires. Uh, I never played it as a kid. Uh, my first, like, Age of Anything game was Age of Mythology. And I never played Age of Empires until the third one came out. Where it's, like, kind of, uh, I don't know muskets and stuff like that kind of starting and everything like that so that's what that's my first age of empires game so i'm i'm starting at age of empires one and working my way up and i just finished the greek campaign but i'm um, still still working what is your favorite snow or savannah mine is uh, savannah i am a i'm an african fan man i love it i love african maps let's go go bro i do like snow though just like me personally. <laughs> I'm counting on things for me. It was in October, but happy Thanksgiving to you. Llama 64. That's awesome, man. That is, that is really cool. But uh, yeah, happy uh, Canada Day. I'm not sure what it is. Squish, what is it? Or, 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 yeah, let me know. Zayden Rathbone, I love your vids. Hey, thanks, Zayden. Appreciate it, man. Let's go check out these fields. Got a 214 Arapaima. 214 centimeter? 214 uh, millimeters? Yeah, I know. Thanks for all the great streams and vids. You should have over a million. <laughs> Bro, maybe one day. <laughs> Taking me into work. Hey, we'll ride on. That sounds like an important thing. You know what, Megan? Seymour is gonna get Call of the Wild 2021. Well, right on. Is that what they have now for like, you know, getting different uh, DLCs and stuff? There's another decent fallow over there. Let's get that guy. Have the wind sort of going in that direction. Oof. Another fallow over here. I see you. See you over there. I see you over there. Been watching you about a month now. I love what you do and you've helped me a lot. We're right on Godzilla, Peter. That's awesome. I'm glad. Hey, do you remember me from your last stream? Love your videos. Real Hunter 09. I don't necessarily like super remember you, but I really try to remember people. So persistence is key. Persistence is key. Lego! Age of Empires 3 shaped you as a person. <laughs> Home family hunting and fishing. Yes, absolutely. And it is a good one. It's, it is my favorite map. For sure. I can't wait for another African map. There's so many good African animals that we haven't been able to hunt yet. But one of these days... One of these days... Hey, you! Stop your walking. Have you considered not walking? Have you considered like standing still? Oh, don't. Oh, what is that? Albino. Albino fallow. Is there a fallow uh, mount with females in it? I can't remember. I feel like there isn't. There we go. We got a couple. That's what matters. Hunt Moe's, please. Hunt Moe's. Who is Moe's and why are we hunting him? Huh? Austin Williams, I'm glad to see you finally hit 10K. Yeah, thank you, Austin. I am happy as well. Jackson Fisher, what's up? snowy outside i'm not upset about it yeah yeah bro last stream of it on youtube because my internet is being unplugged sad sad day no bryce that's sad this is a good looking fallow though 215 215 on his way how high does it need to be i mean i'm eager to see let's see how how close 215 is 215 divided by 251 is that it 215 
divided by 251 is 85%, nearly 86. So that's not bad. It's a pretty decent sized fallow there. We're getting up, getting up there. Some roe deer over there. Hooking hogs with Henry is here right on TH Kilo. Hi hole, hi hole. It's off to TH Kilo we go. If I'm bored, I come and watch your video. Call of the Wilds just for fun and fishing planet for tips. Hey, right on, it's Chase. That's awesome. It seems I like your beginner series on fishing planet. Right on, RWJC Productions. Appreciate it. I'm glad you enjoyed it. I was completely against it until I actually learned about it. I honestly think I'm about to play some fishing plan and watch you right on Godzilla. That sounds great. Shot your first deer today. Right on, Zayden. That's cool. As you killed the dog and got 100%, 400% sad. 80 Smee. 80 Smee. Hi. What is up, 80? Can you not time me out? I, I don't do any timing out, so don't look at me, bro. Mass murder. Mass murder. This albino. I don't think the albinos go with anything. Pretty sure anyway. It's a cool one. I don't know. It's only 2,500. We'll, we'll text. We'll save it and we'll delete it later if it doesn't go with anything. <laughs> BZ is the best. Cody Bowles. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. You know, uh, eh, I feel like I'm okay, <laughs> but I'm glad other people think, think more. That's great. Dakota James Solomon. How's it going? Gavin Ober. What did you miss? Not a whole lot. We destroyed two uh, two flocks of geese, and uh, and now we're hunting some deer. Um, and then if someone lets me know where the European rabbits are, we can go find some European rabbits. But I don't know where they are. <laughs> I haven't even looked for them. So I'll use the. That's right. You use those emotes, Megan. That's great. I've been a fan since 4K. Lamin64. Thank you so much. Who agrees that the best feeling is getting noticed by your favorite streamer? <gasps> oh, oh. When they notice you, you let me know. I'll feel good for you. What are you doing? That's a warning call for your fox. Okay. What would be the animal you would most want to see in the hunter call of the wild? Probably pheasants. I've been saying it for for years. I'm like an old old man now. Old man bow. Just once pheasants. Is that so much to ask for? Oh Jesus. <laughs> I lost my breath right as I shot. <laughs> right over his noggin. See how that does. <laughs> In DB gaming. Hey, hope you have a great day. I am having a great day. TJ, how long are you streaming for till 930 main? When are you playing fishing planet 830? Same as same as every Monday, bro. How long are you gonna be streaming for till 930? Yeah, I already said that. I'm almost 100,000 for the first time PC right on like the hat. Thanks Carson. It's leather. <laughs> Shot a diamond turkey, Danny Man. Danny Man. Right on. Well done. I don't think I don't this shot isn't gonna work. What about the other one? Is that one okay? Did we do anything? Road deer over here. Road deer over here. Where are we gonna find these rabbits? Bye, Dylan. Hi, Dylan. Don't know how I would feel if I killed a tiger. Yeah. I, if I killed a tiger in real life, I, I wouldn't be happy with myself. I'd be very upset. In a game, though, I've killed many tigers. Killed many tigers in games, and it's okay. I'm okay with it. <laughs> I had such a hard time with Fishing Planet, so I deleted it because you, you guys uh, didn't download it. Right on, Llama. Yeah, get it. Carson Peters got eight pointer for the wall right on. That's why I'm on Mammoth to Tame. Cooler Cactus. We used to play uh, Ark all the time, my brother and I. I got him in the lay. What a great shot. That's what happens when you're a professional like me. Great leg shots. Okay. Um, Where are the darn rabbits? This is where I assume the rabbits were. 
over over yonder. We might switch out the shotgun for the 22. Danny man, what's up, BZ? Man, I'm just playing some hunter. What about you? What are you doing? <clears throat> should we get the 22? We should probably get the 22, right? It's not a bad idea. Not a bad idea. I'm guessing anyway. I'm guessing that's what you need for the rabbits if we ever find them. What when I when I saw that the uh, rabbits were coming out, this meadow up here was where I was picturing them being. So I don't know. <laughs> what map are we on? We're on Hirschfeld. Some people say the most beautiful map in the game. Osco Outdoors, love the channel. Keep up the great work. Thanks, Osco. Appreciate it. All right, getting close. Oh, Bjorn. Bjorn's outside. Bjorn's barking. Ethan Phillips loves the great content. Thanks, Ethan. I appreciate it. Not, have not been here for long. Hey, no problem, Bridget. Thanks for being here. Ooh, that's a big one. That's a good one. I saw the weight and I was like, ooh. Oh. oh my god the freaking crouch bug is getting me man cannot believe we missed out on that okay see if I can replicate it okay so I'm gonna crouch and I'm gonna switch weapons at the same time ah oh, it worked okay can't it only why does it only happen when I don't when I really need it to happen <laughs> gosh dang it uh, but it's like when you crouch and then the gun you want to come out doesn't come out and instead he doesn't he doesn't take out any guns and then not only that but he like hides his hands and so then you're like dude take out a gun it's so annoying it is just just take my word for it it's very annoying look at this that's a pretty good looking fallow for just being like a four, I'm taking a picture. Fallow are pretty. Pretty! 218, gosh dang it. He was just, just over. That's probably like right at 86%. Man, I really hoped with his, with his weight he was going to be good. Darn it. Oh well. Okay, this is the meadow. When I heard about European rabbits, I was like, oh, There are European rabbits! <gasps> Dude! When I heard about European rabbits being a thing, I was like, I bet they're going to be in that meadow. Sure enough. I'm so good at this game. Where are they, though? <sighs> when you notice me, we'll ride on, Lana. I am glad. Little CTV, what high-powered guns do you recommend for beginner players? Um, get yourself the 30 out 6 unless you don't have the DLC. Then uh, make your way to the 7mm. The 7mm is kind of game game shattering. It's like, whoa, once you unlock the 7mm, then you can hunt so many animals in the game. I mean, uh, all, all of them. The 7mm goes to class 9. So you can finally go hunt Cape Buffalo and, like... Africa and stuff like that with the seven millimeter like it's such a it's such a good weapon Where are we at right now my guess No one else injures you <laughs> right on Godzilla appreciate it. I feel honored I Even couch anymore in hunter call of the wild gosh dang it is that so I know what to get when I play Call of the Wild? It's the 30 out 6. The Eckers 30 out 6. It's in Weapon Pack 3, I think. There we go. Our first rabbit. There's another one. They were hiding from the rain. It was so rainy outside. We've got. Oh, there's a bunch of them now. We're going to sneak our way up. Sneak, sneak, sneak our way over. Look how many there are, my goodness gracious. I don't see any level 3s though, just level 2s. Do 
Do you love this game? Man, I loved it enough to start a YouTube channel based off of it. Um, back when I was just starting the channel, I was like, you know what? Hunter Call of the Wild. That's a good game. I'm going to do that game. There's a couple of, like, blonde-colored ones, almost. I'm glad that they're hopping around. I was seeing videos of people hunting them when they were glitched, and I just kept thinking, why? <gasps> There's a three! Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, I see you. I see you. <laughs> we have one shot, one opportunity. Sink this shot, everyone. Hey, got him! Boy, they really all hit the deck fast, don't they? <laughs> That's awesome. We got him. Is he gonna be a diamond? Our first, our first European rabbit, diamond rabbit. We're gonna find out, everyone. I'm so behind on the chat. Bo, get a good spot start to stop for a minute. That will be long and you'll have to read this a lot. You are now growing just more months. You'll be a thousand. You are thousands less. Very true, Alex. A journey's when you've become long. You also have a long way to go. I have a feeling for sure. Pure success personified. I was watching Jack Subtkai. He was at 1.5k subs. My goodness gracious. Why don't you remember this for the rest of your channel so you have already lived your dream. Now your dream even farther. 100k, 1 million, and so on. No matter how far away this seems, remember, a dream is not a teaser of what you could only wish you could do. It is not that will never happen. A dream is something that reminds you of what you so passionately want. A dream is beautiful if it stays as a dream, but it is even more beautiful when it is made a reality. A dream is what you should be on the right path to, and you need to take the wheel and drive straight down it no matter how. No matter how something <laughs> Did you get to, you had too many uh chats or something like that they got the youtube doesn't let him go any further our uh, our rabbit has disappeared we can't see it but it's it's there who's subscribing now reed miller okay diamond rabbit everyone it is a diamond a common right it's a common fur type Look, that's a nice looking rabbit. Look how furry it looks. That's a beautiful rabbit. I never knew I would love how a rabbit looks, but I do. It's a it's a beautiful little bunny. And what did I do? I shot it. And it's dead now. But hey, 2.4 right on the dot. Our first European rabbit, and it's a diamond. Well, there you go. That's my first taxidermized uh, rabbit, I think. <laughs> I've never taxidermized a rabbit before. Look at these little burrows. Investigate burrow. Used very recently. Well, yeah, we were standing there. We stand there when we were watching him. We need to, like, set up a, uh, a tripod over here or something, guys. Let's go back and we'll grab a tripod. Just wanted to give you the greatest luck and hope you are enjoying doing what you love. You have a, such a heartwarming community. Hope you get the one mil one. That would be really cool. You know, I think when I get the one mil or when we get to the point where we have like a bazillion people like watching and stuff, the one thing I'll miss is like being able to keep up with the chat. Um, even now, I don't even have the chat on slow. I'm just I'm just slow reading. <laughs> but uh, but yeah, one day I won't. It'll be difficult to keep up with it. But, uh, yeah, gosh darn. We'll see. We'll see when we get to that point. Oh, we're not going to have enough room. <laughs> the Arctic stand. Here, let's get... Hey, we can carry it. Right on. Let's go set up this somewhere. Jump. Yes, we're good. Have you ever hunted in real life? Yeah, I've got videos uh, about that. Cody, go and check them out. It's one of my frequently asked question videos, and uh, I actually put some uh, photos in the uh, Thanksgiving turkey hunt. If you go look for that video. 
but we'll make it to a mill one day. Gosh, that would be cool. Anytime you're not hunting, you're losing your mind. <laughs> Maybe that's my trouble. I haven't been hunting for so long, losing my mind. Join at the right time, apparently. Yeah, that's right, Eli. Dang it, unsubscribe me. What do you mean, llama? The Hunter 780 diamonds, diamonds. Every single possible thing I can put in text is filled with 200 characters. <laughs> Would you get the Hunter 2021? Uh, uh, if I didn't already have everything, uh, probably. It's a great game. And once they're uh, back from all their COVID stuff, I think it's going to be, I think they're going to fix a lot of the problems that we're having in the game right now. So I got high hopes. Even if things do get harder, we are here. Well, thanks Godzilla. <laughs> I feel that's such a, that's such a strange statement. Thanks Godzilla. I feel like a, I'm in a dream state right now. Dreaming about Godzilla and King Kong. <laughs> All right, here we go. Can we set this bad boy up? We need to like set it up in a spot where we can like th look through. I know there's a blind right here, but Jonas, Jonas. I just want to lay it flat. Why can't I lay it flat? I feel like we're going to be up too high. I know it doesn't matter, but just wanted it to be flat. Can we see from here? We can see from here. It's not, it's not amazing. Eh. And we're gonna take it. We're gonna move it somewhere else. Oh, I wanna remove it. Moving it over here. Do you like classic or hunter more? Do I like classic or the call of the wild more? Uh, the call of the wild is more my speed. Uh, I enjoy classic. I played classic for a long time, uh, but it's just a slow game whenever I play it. And uh, and I don't enjoy streaming slow games. Uh, do I want to keep making hundred yard shots? Is the question. Dominic Peretta. Thanks, Dominic. Thanks for the subscribe. Okay, here we go. Final shot. Final decision. Final decision. There we go. 100, 100 yards to the first burrow there. All right, we're going with it. You don't get the virus. Well, thanks, Llama. Appreciate it. You grabbed a Dr. Pepper instead of dinner? No, Squish. We had uh, vegetarian quesadillas, which is basically um, grilled onions with uh, corn and peppers and cheese. You know, you, you, you don't think about it, but a cheese pizza or a cheese quesadilla is, is basically vegetarian. So. so yeah, that's what we had. And I love grilled onions, so that was awesome. It was a good meal. So go and make that, Squish. Come on. See a collab on a game with a hunter call of the wild and farming simulator. There you go. A little bit of farming. That's what they should do on Call of the Wild. They should put in uh, tractors. Put in tractors so we can uh, track tractor around. That's what you. That's the verb of riding a tractor. Tractor around. How long does it take the rabbits to come back out? But you're back, Dak Force. That's true. We haven't seen you in a long time. Avon Moore is now Sweaty TV. I do remember Avon Moore. Now I'm gonna have to remember Sweaty TV. <laughs> Crayon Dinosaur, how would you feel about a dinosaur DLC like the Hunter Primal? You know, I didn't enjoy the Hunter Primal. It was just very meh, and I didn't like it. Um, but yeah, that would be interesting. I, I wouldn't be against it, I suppose. 
the past 20 minutes because they never stop fighting they just die <laughs> they never stop fighting they just die can we see this guy from here like waiting for these rabbits to come out and we're gonna see this fallow deer and he's gonna be massive and we're gonna shoot him and then it's gonna scare all the rabbits back in their holes again <laughs> Come on, rabbits. Come here, rabbits. Coda's cats are being crazy. You know, strong boy, it's very true. Everyone chat, same for you. The only you have more to build up what you want. Oh. Jack Brell and then hi. Do you hunt deer in real life? Not anymore. Used to, though, when I was younger. But, uh, yeah, who knows? Maybe someday. What is your favorite thing to eat on Thanksgiving? <gasps> Ooh, I'm a, I'm a fan of the honey ham, man. I like a good honey ham. It was spiral cut. Ooh, man, now you're talking. Now you're talking. Uh, what about you? What's what is everyone's favorite Thanksgiving? You know on that turkey Thanksgiving video I put uh, at the very end. I was like, I want to see who's made it this far Tell me what your favorite food is for Thanksgiving Only like one person in the comment put what their favorite food is so I feel like no one else made it to the very end <laughs> Throwing a little trick in there got ya got y'all Rip and drag outdoors just subbed. Hey, right on, man. Should you get a weapons pack or a trophy lodge? Well, the trophy lodge gives purpose to the game. So I would say trophy lodge. Be able to put your trophies somewhere. That way you know what you're know what you're fighting for. You know, it's like Mulan. A girl worth fighting for, except it's a it's a deer. A big big deer. Gosh dang it, that buck is in there somewhere, and these rabbits are taking forever to come out. Come on, rabbits. Okay, I'm losing, I'm losing interest. Let's go look over here. I had a dream where I got to play with you. Oh, Llama 64. My goodness, what a dream. <laughs> TCM 24 Van is here, and FaZe. Hi, FaZe and Logan Viral as well okay look here we got another field now we're gonna make our way up make our way up making our way downtown love your laugh oh thanks roger it takes five minutes for them to come out way too long i don't have five minutes what do you think i could die in five minutes i don't have time to wait <laughs> I love your draw vision video. Will seems like a good guy. He did, he was a good guy. Will was a cool guy. And what's funny is that he was from New Jersey. From New Jersey, he was guiding in Utah, and he married a girl from Kansas City. So strange. So he was from the East Coast, basically guiding on the West Coast, and he married someone in the same city as uh, as us. So it was like, it's such a strange world. <laughs> but yeah, we basically just talked about Kansas City for a couple hours. <laughs> Green bean casserole, right on. I missed your other one today. Oh, Benjamin Smith. No big deal. Just a video. You can go watch some other time. Match my hat and t-shirt. But they just didn't take it as far as it could have gone. Yeah. Uh, the Hunter Primal was kind of... It like started as something that their interns were working on, I feel. They said something like that. And uh, they supported it for a little bit. Added a couple of different things in that they wanted to try. Uh, such as like Friendly Fire and... Uh, golly, I'm not even sure. <laughs> just different guns or something like that but yeah um 
then they just kind of stopped. I guess they tested as much stuff as they wanted, or they might have just been just switching to the Hunter Call of the Wild to work on that, and they said, all hands on deck, let's all work on the Hunter Call of the Wild. Who cares about that old engine anymore? Um, since they were, they were using the old game engine for the Hunter Primal. So they might have just given up, said there was no point. There's nothing over there. That's no good. Okay. Tell you what we're going to do now. We're going to we're going to move. We're going to do something else. We're going to do something else. Um, let's go to multiplayer. Leighton Lakes, there's Verhanga. Verhanga would be fun. We only have 13 more minutes, so we're just going to do something random. Oh, okay. Good. I was really hoping that there would be a Verhanga. <laughs> what is your favorite game between Fishing Planet and this game? Ooh, difficult. Uh, probably the Hunter Call of the Wild. I mean, I like I like Fishing Planet um, a lot, but at the same time, yeah. Ooh, there's a bunch of hunting pressure over here. Axis Deer, Blue Wildebeest, and a Mountain Lion. Right on. Well, if you wanted a free diamond, I mean, the Axis Deer are the way to go. But I'm not about that life. Not about the free diamond life. Whenever I see that the animals are bugged and they're giving away free diamonds, I just stay away from them. <laughs> but you know what? My brother and I have always been like that. Like, we are, we are always, like, just never wanting to cheat at a game. Uh... Never wanting, like, even if we did do something that was against the rules, we usually call ourselves out for it. Just because if we were to win, there just there there would be no fun in it, because we just cheated, you know. Um, so, yeah. I mean, I was the person in high school, like, we'd be playing dodgeball, and like, my team would start winning, and it'd be down to like the last two people or something like that, and I would just switch teams and just start playing on the other team, and you know, just destroy so I just I, I never liked things to be too easy <laughs> I do want to make them a little bit harder <laughs> Will must have traveled a lot I agree he must have traveled a lot it's 11 p.m. for you on vacation in Australia well, right on and there is nothing over here Anyone here ice fish? Oh, that's a good question. I've never done that. I've never ice fished before, but I know some people who really, who really like it. Um, I think it's just living up north or something, because I just don't. I'm not able to do any of that stuff. I guess. Yeah, I have one other place. Gosh, will you just select this darn place? We'll succeed. Snowing in Ohio. Well, darn. Dang, man. Not darn. Man, when it comes to December, I'm like, I'm like, snow. Let's go. Snow already. Let's go. I love snow. So, I wish it would just snow all of December. Just makes it more all holiday-ish. Makes it feel like it's truly the, the holiday season. What's your favorite animal to hunt? Oh, I don't know. I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if I have a favorite. It's changed over time. It was elk for a little bit, and then I kind of changed it to... Oh god, I don't even know. Red deer, maybe. There's a cape buffalo. Might have put my 300 away. Did I? Did. Gosh dang it. Don't even have a buffalo gun. Okay, let's get our buffalo gun out. <sighs> Connor Johnston.
Dark Force lives in LA. Right on, man. It's been a while since I've been to LA, but I have I have been there last mm, It was actually two years ago. It's been a while. Live in a box. A box with good internet. Just that one Cape Buffalo, I guess. Oh, there's more. Number six. There's another six. Three. Nice sunset. Wow, it's beautiful. Beautiful. Snow makes it hard deer hunting. How so? Other than getting cold, I always thought the snow helped deer hunting. They like created more contrast. I could see the deer easier. Harrison's done with the work for tonight. We're right on. That's awesome. Peace. All right. See you later, Alex. Thanks for being here, man. Oh, absolutely. Did you do the Halloween event? It's so creepy. Uh, I didn't do the Halloween event on the Hunter. I tried. It wouldn't allow me to do it. Uh, I kept waiting for like the thing to pop up and it never did so I couldn't couldn't get it to go the same heard on Hirschfeld and I posted on discord right on Kevin I'll have to check it out but uh, I did do the Halloween event when it first came out and that was pretty good Benjamin, you just need to press the uh, subscribe button, main. That's about it. Hit the deer in the snow makes for easy tracking. Hey, that too. I mean, <coughs> I never really had that much issue because <coughs> they always just dropped where I shot them. But, you know, whatever. <laughs> but I, I guess I never bow hunted or anything, so... Guess that could be helpful when button bow hunting, but it never snowed when it was bow season here, and then it became rifle season. It was like, eh, why would you bow hunt anyway? Missed the last couple streams. Love the vids. Keep it up, Jack Brell, and then hey, thanks so much, man. Appreciate it. Snow Queen. When you hunt in real life, what was your favorite animal to hunt? Ooh, uh, turkeys. Yeah, the turkeys were so much fun. We uh we had a lot of turkeys on our land, and so they were they were a lot of fun to hunt. Just got back to Arkansas from Great Britain. Hey, right on, eager cloth. That sounds awesome. Did you have a good time? What all did you do? Tell us about it. I heard it won't work on PC, but I'm on PS4. Gotcha. I gotcha. When will the new map come out? I don't know. I don't know. It's almost frog gigging time. Oh wait, that's fishing with frogs. What's up? <laughs> David Probus, how's it going? My goodness gracious. Uh, wet snow absorbs the blood and you can't track it as easy. What? When are you hunting wet snow? Whoa, that's a lot of wildebeest. Come on, there's gotta be a diamond in here. Gotta be, there just gotta be. Hey man, there just gotta be. Oh, there's some over there too. That's the diamond. He's running away. Don't fall for his tricks.
These are all the decoys. Oh, those are red tape buffalo too. The four. Nope, that might have been it. Nope, let's push. Okay. Let's see. Six minutes. No, oh, five minutes. You like to hunt turkey too? Right on, Bryson. One shot, one buck down. Oh, now they're moving. Now they're moving. All right, Diamond. Show your face. Show your face, Diamond. Oh, it's because the Cape Buffalo just decided to just lay down all of a sudden. There's a 584. My wind's going right to him. Oh, perfect. I was going to say, why did they all of a sudden decide to go? It's because my wind was going right to him. I mean, that's exactly what I meant to do. Because I'm a professional, and that's that's what I did on purpose. Oh, oh my goodness, that is quite a name. I couldn't even read it. But thank you for subscribing. I really appreciate it. All the same. Okay, none of these are diamonds very discouraging well see if I had a tripod then we could just go to town That dude just just destroyed a need zone. All right. Don't fall for the driving tricks. I agree. Don't fall for them. Negative 4,000 money and now you're at 10k. Right on. Fishing and Falcon like, hey, speaking of fishing plan, does anyone have anything specific? Like, we can we can obviously uh, frog the glades again. But if anyone has any specific uh, that they want to, like, want me to explain or really want me to fish at a specific place or something like that, like, we can go do that instead. I'm not, I'm not picky. Unless it costs me a lot of money or something. <laughs> Mufasa style. 10 pound unique bass on Everglade. Hey, right on, man. That's what that's all about. Getting those unique bass. You get another one down here. Looks like we just got the two. Oh, well. That's 8.30, everyone. That's 8.30, everyone. Let's switch on over. Oh. My goodness gracious, my poor noggin. Poor noggin. Put that back on. Oh. Switch on over. Switch on over here. I want to see those unique minnows. All 0.234 pounds of them. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. What? You're kidding me. Oh my gosh. There was a really good... Okay, this is what I was wondering. Gosh dang it. I can't even show it to you guys. Can you see this? Yeah. Okay, so I thought I remembered this because last year I thought I remembered getting a really good deal on the premium account and I, I was waiting for it to happen again 
and I couldn't figure it out. But to all of you, and it doesn't help you now because it's already over, but uh, Black Friday through the 29th of November, uh, premium accounts on Fishing Planet are 50% off and 60% off. So, I mean, if you wanted to get a really good deal on premium accounts, Black Friday Fishing Planet would have been fantastic. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> it's over now, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> Okay, so I'm seeing Alaska, um, St. Croix, St. Croix or Alaska. Debbie, how's it going, Debbie? Tiber River. Lone Star, it's either it's either Alaska or or St. Croix, I guess. More people are saying St. Croix or Alaska. It's it's okay, Squish. They're just they're just having fun. Okay, well some people are saying Alaska. I guess we can go to Alaska. I'm f I'm fine with Alaska. It's been a while since I've been to Alaska. I'll have to look at my rods. I might have to change some stuff up. <sighs> hey, you gotta start somewhere, Llama. No big deal. Level 9 is fun. Autumn sale? What? Autumn sale? I'm kind of curious to see what this is. The Christmas magic packs. <laughs> okay, cool. Let's go, accept, leave. 32,000. What game you playing? We're playing Fishing Planet now. Free fishing game. It's pretty fun. It's a, it's a little slow to start, but then after that, it's not, it's not bad. You're a mean mod now. It's because it's called seasoned. You're a seasoned mod now. You know, you've, you've seen some things. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I don't know why it does this on Alaska, but it does. Alaska, Alaska, Alaska. Then you have to, like, look for Alaska. There it is. Okay, got our Alaska license. Um, uh, okay, this might be kind of boring. I'm gonna have to set up some rods. <laughs> Millbrook Meatheads. Thanks, Millbrook Meatheads. Appreciate it. I'm not sure what size of hook we should use. I'm gonna start with five aught and we can go up from there, I guess. That's that might be too big. I'm not sure. Uh shrimp, spawn sacks, and shiners, okay. I'm not sure which is better. I'm gonna go with I'm gonna put those away. Don't need that. I got some shrimps. I think I'm all out of shiners, though. Braxton Richmond! Thanks, Braxton. Shiners are like one of my favorite baits to use. Okay, let's see here. So we're going to put uh, shiners on one, we're going to put shrimps on another, and we're going to put spawn sacks on the last one. Five aughts, I think, should be okay. All right, and then we're going to get uh, a big rod. These are all bottom rods, the thing. So I'm, gonna, I'm not, I'm not going to do that. Let's put, uh, let's put our shiner on here. 
This might not be good. I'm not. I'm not really sure. We can set. We can set the leader pretty big though. Okay, let's do. I need a big rod. I'm not even sure what rods I have. Let's look. Whenever I, I'm trying to remember what rods I have to fish for the right species and like what the weight is and everything, I always go back to the store and like I can see the River Tech Zeus 7 foot 5 there is kind of the best thing I have right now. So I'll probably equip the River Tech Zeus 7 foot 5. And let's see what I got. That's up to 42 pounds. The best thing I've got that I'm not using right now is one of these 36 pound reels. Let's see, do I have anything better than that? Anything better than 36 pounds? Not really, I'm 35 pounds. Okay. Do that. Do we need to put on a uh, titanium leader? I don't know if we do. Got medium spoons, and then we can do. Let's see. Actually, and put that away. Uh, we can throw in some bullet spinners, I guess. I need larger bullet spinners. Um, and then we'll throw in some uh, crankbaits, I think it's a good one. Let's go try this, I guess. Make sure I got everything I need. We could go for some weaker stuff, I guess. I'm not. Uh, eh. Let's just do this. Stop wasting time. <laughs> private times let me put you in my calendar okay we're gonna get in and we're gonna switch the time to 5 p.m. I'm, I'm guessing maybe 6 p.m. you want a saltwater place on fishing planet I do too that'd be awesome Bryson's got to go take care Bryson there were fish in the ocean. I have it. It was a blast. Yes, I have too. We caught some uh, black tip sharks and some bull sharks and a couple of different types of jacks and um, I can't recall what else. Flounder or something like that. Benjamin Smith, hit the subscribe, man. Hit the subscribe button, and that's it. That's all you do. <laughs> Just join. Did you miss anything? A lot of stuff. A lot of stuff, man. Oh, there's Bjorn. Look at this guy wrestling up a Chinook. Oh, no, we have to go over here. 
Get that Chinook in there, bruh. Get him. Get him, Coogee. You, uh, you disappeared. Oh, you got him. Good job, Coogee. You got him. You got him. You got him. What a sport. Look at that face. That's a, that's a face of a champion. Well done. Well done, Coogee. All right, let's, uh, let's throw up a rod stand here. This doesn't make a difference, but we're going to do it anyway. All right. We're going. We're going, everyone. Let's throw our, uh, our, our bottom rods first so we can see what the depth is. Here's our shrimp rod first. Depth is 10 feet. Okay, good to see. So I have that one at five feet. So kind of midway. Got some sea bass in the Gulf of Mexico. Well, right on. That's awesome. And there's a spawn sack on the bottom all right so we got uh shiners at five feet and the rest at 10 feet and then we got our uh crankbait riley abker i love you i love you there we got a fish. It looks like a sockeye, maybe. Or uh, one of those, I can't remember the other type of trout. Uh, coho? It is a coho, right on. Got a little coho salmon, not bad. What? Uh, what are you saying? Socks go on your feet, not your eyes. Ah, uh, I've been doing it wrong this whole time. <laughs> I thought you were a professional fisherman. <laughs> Evidently, the socks go on my feet, not my eyes. Gosh dang it. Is this going to get copyright struck if I hold this in the... Oh my god, yes. <laughs> Sriracha. Raza, how's it going? Hello, friends. Good to see ya. I missed you. Oh my god. I wonder what that sounds like. Was it, that wasn't weird at all. Just kidding. All hail the king. The king ho ho. Should you get a topwater setup or a bottom setup? Hard to say. Um, I use them both pretty frequently, so you just kind of get one and then get the other, I guess. That's a name. Yeah, I know. You say that pronounce the whole thing. Not playing a different game till max level on Fishing Planet. Remember, it's very true, Dallas. Very true. You got a lot of members. That's right. You guys are awesome. My sweater is so cozy. What is up, Chris Mole? I just got it. It is so warm. JJ. Let's go, ca go catch these slamming salmon. Slamming salmon. I'll get Bjorn after I finish eating. I gotta eat. Okay, we tried we tried oh, the crankbait a little bit. Tried to clickbait? Yeah, clickbait. What'd you do? Besides getting 951 out of 750 followers. Yeah, exactly. I exceeded. I exceeded all expectations. Let's try the medium food. Rohan's a bit late. That's okay. Let's see if we can keep this up. Oh yeah, we can, baby. So I like to see. Oh yeah, we're freaking rocking this broom. No, we, we did uh, fry yours for some reason. When I was making quesadillas, I I was making quesadillas, and then uh, for some reason in my mind, I was like, you know what? Ooh, we got a big one. Oh my god, that's awesome. Oh my god. 
gonna stain my sweater. Is it pulling you out in the water? It is pulling me out in the water. Ooh, can we do it? We can do it! Oh golly. Personal best. Here we go. It's a big one. It is a big one. It's hard to take in some line. Not a lot though. You think the trailer for the Call of the Wild to come out tomorrow? Maybe. That would be cool. Good golly. 270 now. Uh, 477. What's really getting me is that when it decides to come in, it's going to come in hard and I've got to keep up the line. Well, you're out in the water. What map are you? We're in Alaska. I remember when I was on that map. You were never in Alaska. You were in Colorado. Alaska. <laughs> Basically lived in your BZF sweater since you got it. <laughs> well, I'm glad you enjoy it. I haven't I haven't gotten one of those hoodies, but they look nice. <laughs> Crawling onto it or into it. What would you rather have on the New Zealand map? I prefer both fallow or whitetail. Uh, yeah, I would like another fallow deer. I live in the United States. I see whitetail all the time. I'm not like super big into whitetail hunting. Just because that's what I've hunted my entire life. So I'm like, why would I then want to hunt them in a game? I can already do it in real life if I want to. I want to hunt something that I can't hunt in real life. Dallas says, how way am I? I am great. I've been locked at my, my computer chair doing homework and work since 9.30 this morning and I'm finally done. Yeah, yeah. Besides getting lunch. Crap. Here we go. Oh my God, dude. This is, this is, okay, so they're coming, it's coming right to me now. This is when you need a really good reel to be able to take in that slack. Cause that's what the salmon do. They just freaking come at you and you've got to be able to take up that slack in the line or else it'll come off the hook. Hello, King Bjorn. What are you up to? I smell back eating dinner. I'm gonna that's eat right. It. I'm, I'm going to go where the, I'm going to go where the food is. Wait. Yeah. Oh my God. That's slack in the line. Burn. Look at that. 250 to 150. That's the slack in the line that you have to keep up. I'm saying the biggest thing when you come to Alaska is making sure that your reel has a really good retrieve. Uh, otherwise, it, those, those big salmon like this one are just going to come off. Uh, they'll take up that slack and they'll they'll use it to get off the hook for sure 150 now I think we got ourselves a unique Chinook whether it's gonna be a PB that's that's the question this is definitely a big fish though oh yeah it's hopped out a few times it's big one. No. Nope. Come on, Hino, hold on. If you lose this fish, you will cry. I'll cry too. <laughs> this is a big fish. Oh, uh, yeah. Cream fish. And Viking bow and jester sack. <laughs> what kind of dog is Winston? What kind of dog is Winston? Oh, is it English bulldog? Okay, because I was like, church. Gorilla. Church is the Rottweiler. Gorilla. Here we're 120. Uh, sub 120 now. Oh, it's gonna come up on the bank. It's gonna come up on the bank. <gasps> hurry! Hurry! We gotta hurry. It's up on the bank. I told you it would go up on the bank. Look at this. Oh! Oh! Got him! 
Boom! That's why I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> when I saw him come up out of the water, I was like, that's a big fish. Unicorn! <laughs> Unicorn indeed! Thank you so much, David. Appreciate it. Oh my god. Yeah, that was a surprise. When I uh, when I first saw him come out of the water, I was like I was just thinking to myself, that is a freaking big fish. Look at that. That is awesome. Looks about as big as me. 58 inches. What is that? That's almost five feet. Not too bad. <clears throat> and they all got to witness you reel it in. That's right. Okay, yeah, some of that sunlight in there. We'll get the mountains in the background. That'll be cool. Get those Alaskan mountains in the background. Lord, that fish is bigger than you. It really is. No, stop rotating, he nail. Bird says he'd be big. So <laughs> okay, he nail is just really not cooperating right now. We're gonna go with that. Right on, two thousand three hundred eighty-one XP, four thousand six hundred twenty-three dollars. Not bad at all. Sorry, I just got an email I was reading. Top notch. All right, we uh, we also wandered away from our rods, but uh, we haven't gotten a bite this whole time. It hasn't told us anything anyway. That thing weighs more than my little brother. <laughs> That's really cool. Oh, this rod did. This rod got taken away. Whoops. Okay, get that back out there. What is that song called? Man, I don't know. I I just play a playlist and I just don't even look, so I'm sorry. I must have missed out on what the when you said that. Oh, the, oh, I gotcha. Um, what is it called? Gosh dang it. Uh, yeah, this one. Um, it's called, uh, I believe it's last time by uh, Killerude. Yep. And the other one is Push the Limit. Push the Limit and Last Time. I'm not sure what Push the Limit's by. Better call Jeremy Wade, that's right. Oh, we are reeling this in really fast. I've been watching you since I started fishing plan. I just reached level 58 today and unlocked Maku Maku Lake. Any tips? I don't have any tips, Elemental. I haven't even got that far yet. It's amazing how uh, when you're when you're playing a game combined with two other games and you're also making videos and doing live streams and editing videos and you know doing all that stuff it's amazing how slow it is to progress through the game god your life's awful i know my, my life is so awful you got what 90 people in here right now i have no idea so uh once i get there i'll let you know hey it could be worse you could be like me Britton. 
I don't even have a computer chair. I sit on the floor. What? <laughs> right on, Samuel. That's awesome. I like your thinking, Dallas. Ooh, had had a nibble there. You should play the hunter and handgun hunt. Yeah, we did that for a little bit uh, at some point. I can't remember when, but we definitely did it. I've seen you sit in chairs. Squish is calling you out, Zach. Squish doesn't know anything. That's a conspiracy, Squish. It's actually just cardboard. Green it's a cardboard cutout that looks like a chair. He's actually just squatting the entire time. Is YouTube your job or do you have another? No, I'm a I'm a freelance designer. Zach's face cam when he puts stream to a chair. <laughs> My optimal face cam would be this. What's up, guys? What's that one streamer guy's name? Nick Merks. Nick Merks here. <laughs> Like the video. Are we playing Fishing Planet? Yes, we are, Caden. Playing some Fishing Planet, man. Can you say hi to Zach for me? Hey, Eli Hicks says hi, Zach. Hi, Eli. It was so hard to find smallmouth bass at San Joaquin. The map is what killed me in the tourney. Gosh dang it. That stinks, David. Next time, though, you'll be prepared. Look at those pretty eyes. Whose pretty eyes? Ooh, look at, oh! Okay. <laughs> he tried to get it at the very end. That's funny. What did I miss when you were on the Call of the Wild? Uh, we shot a diamond European rabbit and a bunch of fallow deer and stuff, but uh, not much other than that. What's your biggest diamond on the on Call of the Wild? Uh, I have two 1000s, a Wildebeest and a Springbok from the previous, from from the, before True Rex came out. Gosh dang it, that was close. What is go oh, it's going with the current. Now I get it. We're not actually getting a fish. It's just going with the current. Will this get you? I don't know if it's another YouTube video, probably. <laughs> Panzerfaust. Oh, who's that? Okay. Then maybe I saw that. I didn't know who it was though, so. Alright, buddy boy. I think you got it. You're over it. I think you got it. <laughs> Squish is over it. Good boy. Alright. Your biggest is a diamond elk OG. Right on. How do you use the crank bit? I'll switch over to the crank bit after this, I'll show you. Jordan and I will be back. All right, sounds good, me. Any tips for level 40? Um, That's a level I am. <laughs> um, honestly, that, I mean, that's kind of in the general area that I'm at. People will swear by the uh, catching the surgeon thing. Um, you could do that. Uh, but I, I just continued to fish for pike. I, I make a lot of money from fishing pike. Um, another thing, uh, the thing you have to realize is that around the 40s is when you start unlocking the carp gear. And so then you can start fishing for carp. Um, and so then you start getting some pretty big carp, like this unique big head carp here. Um... And so then you need some good carp gear. Of course, you don't really need a good carp rod for the big head, 
But once you get into some pretty, and this isn't even big, like uh, my unique car, my unique common carp is only uh, 43 pounds. God, it's a beautiful fish though. The model for the carp are just really good. Um, so 43 pounds, but like the leaderboard common carp is, let's see. Seventy six pounds, so it's it's nearly twice as big as mine. Um, so yeah, the carp get massive, and this is when you can start buying carp rods and stuff like that. I don't have any on me right now because I took them out. But uh, yeah, if you can get a good carp rod and start going after some of the carp, it's it's really exciting. Like I just love carp fishing. Um, but yeah, keep working your way up, man. Get to uh, get to the fifties and start unlocking some other stuff. Um, just have fun with the game, honestly. Uh, what was I wanting to do? Oh, crankbait. Here we go. Let's throw on a crankbait here. I'll show you. So, honestly, the crankbait is like one of the easiest ones you can do. Um, the thing that really gets people, though, is that there isn't any ind indication that, like, you're reeling it incorrectly. So, I'll show you what I mean here. This is... <sighs> Not know what's going on. <laughs> All right, let me show you. So now that my line's way down, um, you'll see that it's it's floating on top of the water right now. Basically, all you're gonna do is start reeling in. Once it, I mean, yeah, once you start reeling in. I mean, that's that's basically it. You'll see it going down. Hi there. Oh boy, you getting a treat? Oh god. Where did you put it? Oh, there's a fish just took that and missed it. So, anyway. Um, yeah. You just need to uh, keep doing that. Like I said, there's no indication on how to reel it in. So you just kind of have to move it up and down. Uh, keep moving it so that you can get it at different depths. Riley Abker, don't spam stuff, man. You're going to get timed out, you silly goober. I think that already happened. So, yeah. Just keep on doing it. That's why the uh, depth of the crankbait is always important. That way, if a fish is at the bottom, then you can go all the way down to the bottom and make sure that you can target those fish, too. Oh, he's cut off. <laughs> it's good this way. Oh, just go this way. Oh. Hello. Hello. Oh, you're falling. Don't get tired. <laughs> Oof. All right. Can you lay down, buddy? That's it. Good boy. Just hits home to me. We'll ride on, Llama. It's awesome. Ooh. Something tried taking that. What is the biggest fish you've ever caught? We caught a, uh, a tarpon back when we were uh, using the Bass Boat Explorer Pack. I think it was 119 pounds. That's our biggest one so far, but um, before that, I'm not really sure. We'll have to look and see what our biggest one is other than that. I feel like it's an alligator gar. We've caught a pretty big alligator gar too. It was like number four in the world for a little bit. I'm not sure where it's at now. Dog, you are very cute. <laughs> Dog's cute. They say you're cute, dude. Oh, he's not. Not cute? No, don't say that. Or you're mean. What's the best way to catch shiners at Lone Star Lake? Uh, semolina balls, I think. I had a lot of luck with semolina balls. Let's try a different color. Jordan is a barbarian. It's cloudy, so you think that the colored uh, crankbait should be really good, but it's just not doing very well. 
Not making a lot of money. Uh, level 24, you should be going to... You could be either fishing for smallmouth and largemouth at Naharan, or fishing for largemouth at the Everglades, I believe. Right, Gavin? So that's what, that's what you could be doing. <laughs> Dow says that you must be nice to King Bjorn or you'll be banished. Is it possible for a PS4 player to play with me? No, unfortunately not. No crossplay with PS4. Wicked me, remember you. It's not coming to mind at the moment. Not not at the moment anyway, but you know, a little bit of a... I have 90 likes. I have 90 likes? Well, my goodness gracious. I <laughs> want Alice in the play fishing planet. <laughs> you might get Santa's kayak pack because I don't have any boat and low on money and want to play on White Moose Lake. You know what? A, a boat isn't necessary to fish White Moose Lake. You can ca you can catch ton of fish from the dock. Um, and honestly, a beginning kayak really isn't that expensive. Uh, ooh, just got something else here. I think it's uh, another Chinook, but it's smaller. Good old King. Bjorn, look, we got a King Salmon online. It's a smaller King Salmon. Yeah. Little trophy Chinook. Little trophy Chinook, Bjorn. $1,400. You should check where your gar is at. Yeah, we should. Let's check right now. To be awesome on the internet. <laughs> uh, Bye, David. David's leaving. Have a good night, Squish and Megan. Hey, take care, David. Hit the pillows. Get them big oons. Get them big oons. <laughs> oh yeah. Thanks, David. And uh, take care, man. All right. Where are we at now? My golly. I wonder if uh, I wonder if the uh, leaderboard got reset. Right now, the top is 99 pounds. Let's see what ours is. Ours is 98.783. So that would be right at number five. We would be number five in the world right now if the leaderboard hadn't reset. What? So who's biggin? It's a big fish. All right, right on, man. Ten o'clock. All right. Here's our twenty-four minute drive. Right on. Zombie cat, ninety-two pounds. Man, for ninety-two pounds, we just did not fight this guy at all. That's crazy. Okay. Anyway, there's my tops. 92 pounds black vampire gar there. I guess we'll look at this guy. That's crazy. Let's try to catch some more Chinooks now. I want to apply my whole face to Bjorn's face. Squish. <laughs> Samuel Trotter! Okay, bye. Ten K sub special, yes. Um, I'll tell you all right now, since you are in the live stream, it's gonna be a little tricky. You'll have to pay attention. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna make it I'm gonna make it a thing. But if you if you think about it, it's going to improve your chances of getting a prize. So, so yeah, it's going to be good. I feel bad if I say, or didn't say goodbye. Goodbye, everybody. Have a great night. <laughs> Bye, Zach. Bye, Zach. Have a good one. Okay. We haven't tried this blue one out. Let's try this blue one.
downloading fishing planet <laughs> right on llama get it get it man your first tattoo will be of beard oh gosh Austin Kitching, how's it going? Yeah, I mean, it's first fish. Uh, it's a it's a free game, is what I'm trying to say. First fish. How long have you been streaming? Since 7:30 tonight. What do you mean, like, ever? Gosh darn it! Get over here. This game seems so cool. Relaxing game. It is a relaxing game, that's for sure. That was a big splash. <laughs> Gogger is here. So happy. Yeah, agree, man. Haven't seen you in a long time. Hi, Dakota. That's exactly right, Among Us. Very true. Would a 17-pound rod setup do good at White Moose Lake? Absolutely. That is all you need, man. Hunting Sim finished installing. Right on. Merry Christmas, BZ. Cold face. Merry Christmas. Maybe Alaska. It's Nerf. Tell you what, we are not catching anything on these rods. Like, they're just not doing anything. I'm not sure if it's because the hooks are too big. We can go down a hook size, I guess. A couple hook size. Let's go down a lot. Bo, your two hours go by fast. <laughs> Do they? I feel like we get a good amount of stuff done. I'm gonna put a one-odd on. I don't know. <laughs> Just to see if we can get a fish. Uh, I feel like a four-odd should be good though. I feel like we're just not getting any bites. Best two hours of your day. Aww. Fishing in real life, not getting a single for bite within a couple hours is still fun in a game. I'd say not so much. I tried the game. It's just not for me. Man, if you're not getting a bite in two hours, you're not playing the game right. <laughs> You should definitely get more fish in this game than you do in real life. Uh, so if you're not getting a fish in two hours, uh, change some stuff, watch some videos, Redux, because um, you're not doing something right. Uh, you should be getting a fish every couple minutes, and that's why we're moving spots right now because we're not getting bites. We have two minutes on the premium count to go. Kevin's beating his brother in Madden right now, right on. Eli's got to go. Hey, take care, Eli. Mom wouldn't won't let me do it. I have the Hunter Call Watts. So I'm happy about that, I guess. Yeah, that's not bad, man. Got a five pound bass right on. Bye, Llama. Take care, man. I love winter. I love winter, too. Ready, steady, po. Check the weather. Check the weather. Check the weather. Check the weather for what? I'm gonna go back to that medium spoon. I'm gonna try this medium spoon out for a little bit. Use a two watt hook to get more bites. You think that's the that's what we need to do, Sports Super? Got a nibble there. Another nibble. Must be a smaller fish. Really, Redux? My goodness gracious. Ooh! Had a fish right at the end. <laughs>
Remember the top and bottom question. What makes more money of the two? Uh, they both make good money. Both, both of them. I don't know. Oh my god. What? Why does our line keep doing that? Oh, you said by the Eli. Oh, I read all. God. Hook him. Oh, I got freaking snagged on something. Shells. I love shells. Shells is best. <laughs> People ask me, what's your favorite thing to catch in this game? Shells. That's the, that's the, that's the answer. For the advice, I just caught a unique smallmouth. Hey, right on, Gavin. That's awesome. Mr. Gamer Guy's got to go. Okay. Bye, Mr. Gamer Guy. Take care, man. Kenyan Strange. Sup. Sup, Kenyan Strange. What's up with you? Do you think I should have in fishing? I'm level 26 and I've been grinding money at Emerald Lake. Yeah, continue grinding money at Emerald Lake, Yosef, and, th and then start saving up money to buy uh, pretty decent match rod setups uh, for uh, Pike at St. Croix. That's your next, your next go, man. Look at that. Good coho at the end there. Or, uh, gosh dang it, Sockeye. Didn't mean to say coho. Knew what I wanted to say, I just didn't say it. <laughs> <laughs> what you do already and your personality F SFG whip thanks man I appreciate it do you hunt BZ used to hunt used to hunt all the time man I got videos about it I actually put some pictures in the uh, the uh, Thanksgiving uh, episode if you go back and watch that I put some turkey hunting pictures in that but not so much anymore Ooh, look at that. Oh my goodness. Got ourselves a Chinook, I'm guessing. It's a small Chinook, but it's it's a it's a Chinook. Winter's fun when the snow comes, but when it's cold and there's no snow, when that's not fun. <laughs> so we really get cold like 19 degrees. I got you. Yeah, I understand. 10 minutes until fishing plan is done for you. Yay. 10 minutes until fishing plan is done for me as well. So enjoy it, man. What's your favorite lake in the game? Oh, you know, it just constantly changes. It seems like every lake I unlock, I like it better. Um, St. Croix is a pretty safe go-to, though. I, I love St. Croix. Forgot about your stream. Janelle, no problem. No problem there. $2,000, 31 pound Chinook. Not bad at all. <laughs> Winnipeg kid, sorry you're late. Hey, no big deal. You still made it though. That's all that matters. It's the people who show up like two minutes before the stream ends. That's what gets me. <laughs> you all just wait. Someone's gonna show up like two minutes before the stream ends, and then you can all just you can all just spam at them. <laughs> JK, don't do that. That's mean. Hey, we got another fish. Ooh. Ooh, little Chinook. There we go. A little Chinook 15 pounder. I love how that's a little 15 pounder. Like, if you caught a 15 pound fish in real life, that'd be great. That would be awesome. A squish coin, a squish coin. I used to get Canadian dimes every once in a while. Another one, a little small one. 99 likes, are you serious? That's crazy. Get to 100 likes. A little 17 pound Chinook. And we're, we're just pouring in the Chinooks now. What is best spot? Best spot for fishing. Right next to the edge of the water. I'm telling you. 
That's where I catch all of my fish. You go up to the edge of the water and throw out that you're that's where you're gonna catch them. I'm telling you. That's where I catch them anyway. 100 likes! Yes. I'm getting so close. Right on, Janelle. Little bit, little bit. When's your next stream? Wednesday. Monday, Wednesday, Thursday. Same time, 7.30 to 9.30 p.m. Central. Don't miss it. By the end of this year, you can do it, Gogger. You can do it. Barbless hooks get more XP? Meh. Whatever. I guess I probably could do it because I'm pretty good at keeping good tension. But eh, whatever. <laughs> Someone who didn't like it. Where I should fish, I really appreciate it. Yeah. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Woo, we both got pretty decent sized fish, though mine's pretty small. His is pretty small too, I guess. Guessing we got another like 35 pounder or so. It's pulled us out a little bit now. Might be up to 40. Might be up to 40 pounds. I don't want BZ stream to end. No. No. Don't end. Will you or have you played Call of the Wild this stream? Congrats on hitting 110k and getting married. I believe you did. That's yes, right, Levi. Did get married. And we did hit 10k. Yeah, yeah, we did play Call of the Wild. We started off with Call of the Wild and now we're ending it with Fishing Planet. It's kind of the the order of things on Mondays. Started off with a literal bang and then uh and then hook people at the end. Hook hook fish at the end, not people. What is your biggest lake trout? Um, I'm not sure. 40 40 some Oh, this is a coho. What? Well, how about that? That was a surprise. That's awesome. Did not expect that. I thought it was just another Chinook. That's awesome. 900 some XP, that's great. Ugh. Six more minutes. What's my biggest lake trout? Let's look. It is. Did we pass already? Oh, is it looking? Um. There it is. 45 pounds. 45.007 pounds. Not a bad fish there. Where's that stack up with uh leaderboard we would be we wouldn't even be in the top 100 45.007 pounds yeah we'd be off right yeah huh how about that Do I have a PS4? No, I don't. Zach has a PS4, though. How do you make money when you're around level 20? You uh, fish in the Heron, Brian, or fish in the Everglades. Oh, yeah, that's true, sports tour. Gonna try your best to make it to the next stream. Right on, Gogger. Appreciate it. Booty!
I gotcha. Got a bigger one. Pixar didn't happen when it picked kids. No one believes you. <laughs> there is, you know, we have we have uh, the trophy section of the uh, Discord. That's where you can uh, put put your picks so that people believe you. Otherwise, don't believe you. <laughs> You're number 31 on the pink salmon leaderboard right on that's awesome what's your biggest in real life carp not big i think it's 10 and a half pounds it was nice though it was a nice fish when are you going to frog fish at the everglades you know i've got so many live streams of that um and uh i have a video of that as well if if you're really wanting to watch it uh otherwise uh some other people wanted me to go here, so. So we came here and said, a little sockeye salmon here. So, well, that was the plan though. We were going to go to the Everglades and, and frog for some bass, but uh, change of plans, I guess. My friends and I have all had bad experiences with North Carolina's like, really? North Carolina's great. It, it is awesome. Small mouth and large mouth. I just cast around that car constantly. Um, yeah, it was awesome. Your grandma and grandpa have a husky. Ooh, okay. Cool. Hey, good night, Sharon. Take care. We got two more minutes in the stream. Here we go. Uh, by the way, I'm going to show you all a little something I've been working on at the end of the stream whoever's left um it's not it's not much it'll be better once there's some music in fact i'll simulate it i'll simulate it and uh and i'm thinking about making a few of them maybe two i'm thinking of maybe just doing two but uh yeah should be fun because i realize not like the music we're listening to right now is uh alternative hip-hop hip or uh, lo-fi music, which I enjoy a lot. It's what I listen to like all the time. Um, and then, uh, but I realize not everyone listens to that. But anyway, one thing I was really wanting to do was a the Hunter Call of the Wild themed lo-fi music uh, for like half an hour or an hour, something like that. So that's what that's what I'm gonna do. What should you go for in a Heron River? Uh, large mouth and small mouth. Like I said, just cast around the, the car and you should be good. Golden, man. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, Harrison. Go. Tan Tan, I know you're a big fan. I know you are, man. <laughs> R.I.P. Walker, how's it going? Get it, get it. No. Urgh. I want to catch one more fish before this ends. Come on. One more fish, that's all I want. <laughs> YouTube needs to alert you when we're live. Come on. We're live the same days every week, cat. You can't use that. Set an alarm on your phone. <laughs> 7.30 on Monday, 7.30 on Wednesday, 7.30 on Thursday. Come on. One fish, that's all I want. One fish. Uh, I don't know. That will be really cool. If so, then I've got a, a busy morning on my hands because I'll be making a video about it. The famous one more. Yeah, that's right. Could be five minutes. Could be one minute. Could be ten minutes. Had a nibble there. There we go. Fish on. Oh, man. About got off the hook. Little coho. Coho to end it. Right on. We got it. Okay, so here we go. I'm gonna I'm gonna simulate this. 
everyone. Let me get this going. I can't remember which one I was going to start it with, though. Here it's it. Okay, this is what, this is what we're going to do. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 uh, there we go. Yes, that looks so good. Okay, so here we go. Picture this. I know, I mean, it's not, it's not much, but it's the first one I'm doing, so I think it's cool. Okay, so picture that. And then uh, for 30 minutes, it's just going to be. Look at that. Look how cool that is. So yeah, that's uh that that is gonna be a video. It's just gonna be like a half hour of music. That way, if you ever want to listen to some some Christmas lo-fi in the background of doing some homework or something like that, got a the Hunter Christmas themed lo-fi music to listen to. <laughs> and you got reindeer or uh, Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer. So yeah. So anyway. Hope you all like that. I thought it was pretty cool. I was I was excited about that. But anyway, take care, everyone. Um, also, look forward to um, a new uh, cover art, and the channel logo will change tomorrow with December. So look forward to that if you're into that artsy stuff. But uh, other than that, take care, everyone. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Like if you haven't already. Oh. Like the video if you haven't already, really appreciate it. And uh, as always, remember everyone. We're one planet, one family.